after this pandemic, there's going to be a new normal. And I think it's going to be a wake-up call for a lot of people and a lot of businesses that recognize the fact that, hey, you know, we can still be productive and effective when our workforce isn't here 40 hours a week. Yeah, no, I 100% agree. And yeah, if we could predict the future, <laughs> we probably yeah. wouldn't be sitting here on this podcast. But <laughs> no, and I agree. I think one of the, the other things that kind of struck me, you know, the different mindset when you're single versus when you're married and then when you have a family, right? How that, I don't know, the, the dynamic definitely changes, but being intentional should be consistent. I found I was not right now. I can't go back and revisionist history and change it. And like I said, I, you know, better late than never figuring out the balance between the family and personal and career and all that good stuff. What's your viewpoint of that? Gosh, you know, I think we're, we're all made so differently, right? So what's going to work for me may not work for you or may not work for the single the 28 year old. So I just think that it's on each of us to identify and define what it is that makes us tick, what it is that, you know, helps us get out of bed in the morning. But you really have to run the miles, don't you? Yeah. Like you really have to find your own path and base it on your own experience. Um, your purpose is different than mine. You know, you're, the reason you find meaning in your work, we could do the same exact work. I could run a similar podcast, but we maybe find meaning in different ways. Sure. Uh, so I really do think that's unique to each of us as individuals, individuals. And I feel like that's one of our jobs, <laughs> right, is to figure out what that is. And unfortunately, you know, time can be our greatest teacher. So these things take time. There aren't shortcuts for these things. I think it's usually a journey. And I think you have to be intentional about that journey. And you have to pay attention to all the milestones, the small wins, and, and some of the setbacks along the way to really identify what that looks like.